Hello internet and uh, welcome back. Um, God, I, I do apologise if I sound really rough in this video. I think it's a bit of a double whammy at the moment. Um, not only am I getting over the flu and that viral infection, um, but this morning um, I had a drink of um, some ginger juice that was in the fridge um, and it seems it's got to be drunk within 30 days of opening. Um, literally within five minutes I was so ill. So I think I've got, um, if you can get food poisoning from, from a drink, I don't know. But I certainly had some because I was sweating buckets, uh, felt rough, sick. Oh, yeah, it was horrible. Anyway, um, one job I did want to get done today is obviously pick this little 1400 Tigra up yesterday. And I want to run um, the diagnostics on it just to, uh, to see if there's anything that comes up. That needs my attention really so i'm um, going to plug in the obdc reader uh strike at vaxcom or voxcom or whatever you want to call it and uh, and see what that yields for me right engine first and uh basically you're doing this at the same time as me this is the first time i've looked at it so let's see what we've got A little bit slow this version but um, it does come up in time um, it doesn't run the virtual server it runs off some sort of um, faker program I don't know right let's have a look at the fault codes O2 sensor intermittent right well it did come up on the MOT that um, it was 0.1 or something over on the emissions so that would kind of make sense if the O2 sensor is uh, is slightly intermittent bank one sensor ones that's the top one on the cat um could just do with the clean to be honest if you don't give these cars a good run they can choke up and uh it could be that but um it's cleared okay so um, something to keep in mind at the moment right let's go through the rest of them and uh, let's see what else comes up on the diagnostics Right, I'm going to go into the body control module because that's basically where a lot of the errors can feature up, especially with the roof, the windows and that kind of thing. Um, the roof works okay, the, everything works okay on it, the boot. And uh, I don't expect to see much in here, but let's have a look anyway. Fault codes. Uh, right, comfort closing low voltage, that could have been because the battery's disconnected. Also the ultrasonics, yeah, all of those, I know it's had a new battery. Uh, so I would guess that those, because they're not present, actually the ultrasound malfunction same present. Let's just clear those and have a look what comes back. But I know it's definitely had the battery changed. Um, right, well let's clear those anyway. So I'm not going to worry too much about those either. Right, let's go back and the last thing I want to check is just the um, the hard top just to make sure that nothing's coming up on there that needs attention. To be honest, everything works fine and looking at the diagnostics here, there's nothing that really concerns me. Um, I want to clean up the throttle body because that can throw O2 sensors out. I also want to check O2 sensor just in case it's old and broken. Uh, the wires frayed or something crazy like that there you go no dtc's present so happy with that so just basically have a look through it check it and make sure everything's okay it does run fine it dries fine everything about it's good so yeah it's just a case of um doing the little bits and bobs that need doing and um well make a decision whether i'm going to keep sell or, or what i'm going to do anyway that was the first check so thanks for joining me and um more content to come soon um, and hopefully I'll feel a lot better by then. <laughs> Thanks for sticking with me, Internet. Catch you later. Bye-bye. A few moments later. Now you know I can't resist a tinker. So, I've took it out anyway. Let's give it a clean, see what happens. There you go, it's had a good clean-up. And uh, some of the good stuff sprayed in the end there. Let's see what that does. So, let's start it up and have a listen. Because you could hear it slightly chugging before. Well, that started a bit smoother and it's running a lot smoother as well 
so maybe just maybe oh no no there's a little bit chug in there you can probably hear it I've got an O2 sensor in the back here, so um, let me have a quick look. I'm sure, I spotted one. Yeah, there's one. But I don't think that's number one. I think that's number two. So I think I changed the wrong one. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get the math for clean as well. See what happens. I think I'll do it for now though, because yeah, I'm really not feeling it today. Cheers, internet. Bye-bye. Well, that's what I mean by the chugging. That's better. Clean the throttle body. Clean the math. Clean the O2 sensor. And now, it's really sweet as a nut. Easy as. <laughs> Simple fix, good old voxels.